We've all been in a situation when we're away from our computers and the only thing we have is our trusty iPhone or iPod Touch. And then of course you remember that you forgot to start a file transfer. Well, luckily for us, there's a wonderful application in the iTunes App Store that is called Mocha VNC. The full version is $5.99 and it's got just a couple different features and the light version is free, of course, and it's just missing a couple of the vital features. I have the full version which I paid for, and you open it up, and then you hit the connect button. And as you can see on the other side of the screen is my Kodak EasyShare ZD8612, which is focused on the screen of the laptop, so you can see the movement. Right now I'm moving it with my hand right there, and, oh, there, it's the wrong computer. See? When you disconnect menu, edit connections, I'll add another one. That's my uh, desktop 192.168.1.111. Now we're going to add this one, which is I think 108, if I'm not mistaken. Let me look. Ah, come on. Yes, 108. So we will put in 192.168.1.108 then the DNC password move it away right quick not that it really matters because it's my password and my network and everything but then we'll just click connect and it'll start negotiating BNC negotiation the screen will go black temporarily and now you can see the information that's on a laptop screen. Turn it into landscape mode and it also goes into landscape mode giving you closer and then I can move the mouse as you can hopefully maybe see on the ZD8612. You can right click okay it's working on it. There it is. Right click left click of course I can you use the multi-touch to zoom in. See, there's the microphone thing from Geeks Radio. Say we want to open up. Uh, let's just open up FileZilla. Just double tap it, and as you can see on the Kodak camera, it's starting to work. It's loading up, and now we wait. This computer's not usually this slow, it's just, I think, oh, there it is. Yay, it loaded. Awesomeness. Now we can do everything that we could on the normal computer. I think I will now connect to my, uh, let's just connect to BB Tech Help FTP site. There we go. Now we see the public HTML content. You might be asking why I'm doing this, and it's just strictly to show you how this works and how cool it is. I could just be showing you the plain old desktop, but that wouldn't be any good, so I'm just showing you some of the cool features that Mocha VNC has to offer. Then I can just click the X up here. It also has this little mouse offset feature, which you can use if it's taking too long. There we go. Or if it's off center. Sorry, I bumped the camera there. Then we can zoom back out. And it has full keyboard. First button here is a standard QWERTY keyboard. Then we'll hit the world thingy. There's the emoji. And control and Alt are on this keyboard. Then the second keyboard is kind of like a it's kind of like a other feature keyboard like it's got all the F keys and the Windows key and so that's pretty much it this is Mocha VNC it's an iPhone application that is six dollars five ninety nine for the full version and the light version is free it allows you connect to connect from your iPod or iPhone from pretty much anywhere in the world as long as you have the server running and you have the IP address you can find this and all the other posts at bbtechhelpbb.site90.net. 
where I post all the text versions, and I've been using Twitter a lot lately just for random things. That's twitter.com slash bb windows help bb. And I have a bunch of different reviews coming soon, so keep a lookout for those. Thanks for watching, and hope this review has helped you. Bye.